Hi guys, it's me Malcolm, the movie Wizard of Oz himself. And it's the first day of February. Oh my God, I'm so looking forward to this month because we get to see some new movies like 80 for Brady, which I already saw, as you can see. See? Cocaine Bear, which I'm not going to see because because I do find it quite ridiculous. But I'm mostly looking forward to seeing Ant-Man and the Wasp, Quantumania, okay? So, so I'm here to discuss my review of this awesome YA adaption that I should have done a long time ago. It's, and it's been 10 years since this movie came out. Warm Bodies, starring Nicholas Holt, Teresa Palmer, John Malkovich, Dave Franco, and others. I gotta say, this was one incredible movie. It's like Twilight meets Romeo and Juliet, but with zombies. Whoa, it is incredible. I gotta say... I do believe 20, 2013 was a com was a comeback for zombie movies. Not only this, but also World War Z. See, I swear, I remember it like I remember that year like it was yesterday. So yeah, as you can see, this involves involves a zombie named R who who suddenly fell in love with a love with a human name named Julia. Uh, their romance set an emotional sequence of event that might transform the entire lifeless world. Boy, it was boy, this movie was incredible. incredible. It did have some great moments though. Though it, it, and it is quite funny though. I did really I believe one of my favorite scenes is where Julie had to play dead beg among among the undead. How she just went too much with it. <laughs> Incredible. <laughs> so funny. Um, what else do I like? Oh, one of my favorite scenes is where R dreamed. Dream when when he saw when he saw the other three humans, humans, I really did like that part. It was inc it was awesome though. But I was but I am shock shock how not only are are changed but also the other zombies. I mean, how they finally finally decided to cure themselves. It was it's like they're it's like they it's like they have a conscience now. It's a, I gotta say, it is, it is so exciting. Like, it, it was quite, inc I do find it quite incredible though. Whoever, what are the odds, odds they made this book into an awesome movie? It is pretty cool though. I really love everything about it. Okay then. So for my score for this awesome movie, I think I'll give it a nine. Definitely a nine. Okay guys, I guess that's it. So if you like this video, like, comment, subscribe, and be sure you all stay safe and stay healthy. Bye.